Okay, so we're going to try to make this fight as consistent as possible. Right now I have a plus 5 halberd with 32 strength, 18 dexterity, and 25 stamina. Stamina only really matters if we are attacking multiple times, which we're not. So what you want to do is you want to always have Smo in the picture. If he dashes towards you, roll into him, R1, and hopefully you'll hit him unless he's being a hobby boy, which he was, and that's okay. Don't panic. Uh, okay, so the attacks that you want to punish are... He's standing still. <laughs> Obviously. We also want to punish that jump leap roll into him. You want to punish this attack by rolling R1. As long as Smo isn't there. Uh, don't punish that slash because he can do up to a four hit combo. Oh, you're being annoying. And a dash. You want to roll into him and roll in our one hit. He's going to jump and attack, which we can punish. Punish him standing still. I'm going to quit out to reset the fight, and I'll try and get the other uh, intro. Okay, so once again, we're uh, plus five. If he dashes, we roll into him, rolling R1. You can turn around after you press R1, punish his swipe swipe. He does a stab forward, slash slash, and overhead slam or thrust. He's going to dash, so we want to dash into him, pulling our one. If we miss, that's fine. Just make sure you don't get pulled. by smoke. The stab you want to roll, see? Wait from him when he dashes. Dodge. <laughs> Alright. Of course, I make mistakes while I'm recording. Him standing still. If you hit him with a rolling R1, you can follow it up if he's standing still with a regular R1. And that will stagger him so you can do another attack. As long as Smo is not. Oops. But we always keep Smo in the picture. He's going to do scoop. No, he didn't follow it up. It's fine. And a dash, we roll with him. R1. Don't get hit at the end. Roll that. If you're doing hitless. Even if you're not doing hitless, you should still roll away from smoke because you're here. Alright, so we're gonna go on here. Hopefully, we'll get the other animation. So he's dashing, we roll away. He can be a hoppy boy, so if you miss, that's fine. The second attack will stagger. Gets most stuck in the corner. Roll into it. He's a hoppy boy, he runs away. Punish him standing still. Be careful with uh, Smo. Um, he leap strikes. It's fine. Walk into the other. Dash towards him. Dash. Don't roll away with him. <laughs> like I was just doing. Don't roll away with him because if you do, uh, you can still get hit at the latter most end of your uh, high frames, so be careful with that. Always roll into him, not away from him. I'm going to reset my health just so I can, uh, for the sakes and purposes of this video, I want to stay alive. Hopefully we're going to uh, get the other attack animation we did not. So if he walks towards you, punish him. Um, I don't know what he's doing. So that attack, we can rolling R1, punish. Once he stands still after being a hoppy boy, we can hit him. Dodge. Dodge. Hit him again. I'll respond to questions when I'm done recording. We're going to enter into the right. He's going to dash. I'm going to dodge into him. 
own our one. Regular our one, as long as we have Smo not sprinting towards us. Alright. Counter hit him, so I did extra damage. Reset the fight. Enter in on the right hand side. I want to show you the other. Ah, so he's walking towards us. If he walks, we walk. If he dashes, we roll. He's going to hit the pillar. We're going to attack him through the pillar. Gonna be a hoppy boy. We're gonna make sure that Smoke can't hit us. Two hits, he staggered. Five hits, he's dead. If you get critical hits, uh, it's four hits. It's anywhere between four and seven hits if you're unlucky. So once again, we're gonna enter into the right. He's gonna dash, so we roll. Rolling our one. He's standing still. Punch. Make sure you have enough time to get away from Smo as he almost always does his uh, shovel. Shovel scoop. You want to attack between Smo's attacks. I failed to roll. Uh, that's very unlucky. Punish. Well, Smo is doing things we punish Ornstein. Now I'm going to try and show you the uh, attacks that we can rolling R1 and the things that we can just regular R1. Um, phase 2 is for when you do running R1, regardless of which one you're doing. So that one, uh, if he's a hoppy boy, obviously don't try and punish. But if he's not a hoppy boy, hit him through the pillar like I did in the previous one. This one, you can rolling R1 into it. Damn it. Of course. Of course that happens when I'm making a video. Alright. If it's Hinky, get out. Get out. For that one, wait until he's done with the second one. Regular R1. For this attack, pull away. Ignore. No. That one you can regular R1 punish at the end of his animation. That one you can R1 punish if you're right next to him. If not, that's okay. Dash into it. Failed. I still hit him. Lucky. But if you miss an attack, don't try to follow it up. If you miss an attack, walk away, reset the fight. He dashes forward, we want a rolling R1. If he was a jumpy boy, that's unfortunate, but that's okay. Don't punish that slash, as he can do a three hit, four hit combo afterwards. Um, so just walk away from that one. This attack, he can do a four hit combo, so uh, don't punish it. Rolling R1. I got hit because of Smo, because I did what I said don't do. Uh, that's fine. Dash forward, rolling R1. R1 for the punish. If he's standing still, punish. If he's stepping backwards, and you've already hit him. So remember, the second attack after you hit him will stagger him if you have a plus five weapon. So if you rolling R1, hit him, and he's just kind of standing there, hit him again. Even if he's charging up an attack, hit him again, because you can stagger him out of that next animation, and you can start walking away again. I wouldn't recommend punishing him a third time, because he might be low on stamina, or uh, Smo might be right behind you. So that's how you do Ornstein, phase one.